Hey guys, Aegis here. I'm going to run through a quick video on Fusion, tell you what it is and how you can do it, and what the benefits are for you. So first of all, you're going to want to go into your workshop. Go into the menu on the left-hand side, look for the tools, and we're going to go into the upgrades. So in here, you've got a few boxes. Over here is where you're going to put the things you want to destroy and take the fusion points from. You're going to put the item you want to put all of those points into in here so that you can upgrade it. And then here's all of your items that you can place over there. So, to give you an example, let's go and we'll pick a torso to upgrade. Let's take this electric guardian. You can fuse other items or you can also fuse fusion kits. So, if you want to fuse other items, put the item you want to upgrade in the box. And then all you have to do is click on the items that you want to fuse into it. They show up on the left hand side. And then you can click the upgrade button. It shows you here how much power you're going to gain. The bar up above shows you the current power of your item and what the power required to get to the next level is. When you're upgrading torsos, every level gives you another five hit points added to the hit points already in the torso. For weapons, it adds plus one damage for every level. The maximum level you can upgrade an item to is 16. That'll give you plus 15 damage, or it'll give you plus 75 hit points. So, if we destroy these three fire guardians to increase this electric guardian, it's going to go from 372 hit points, and you can see 450 is going to be enough to get us to the next level, so it's going to go up by another five hit points. So let's go ahead and click Upgrade. It's going to confirm that you want to destroy the items to upgrade it. We're going to click the check mark to do that. And there we go. We actually fused enough points to go up two levels. So it gained 10 hit points. When you look at the torso now, you can see it's 372 is the base hit points, plus 10 because we've brought it to power level 3. You can also see that if we put another 600 points into it, we can bring it up to level 4 and get 15 hit points. Let's go ahead and put a whole bunch of fusion points into it and show you what it looks like when it gets up to level 15. I've got some newbie torsos here that have quite a bit of fusion points in them as you can see. About 537,000 is enough to get a level 30 item all the way up to power level 16. So we're going to take this newbie torso, we're going to fuse it into this electric guardian and watch what happens. The hit points go up and up and up and up and up, and now this is what you'd call fully fused. You get that nice dark black color, it's power level 16, and it has an extra 75 hit points. This doesn't add any weight to your torso, and it doesn't cost you anything other than the fusion points. So as you can see, fusion is a great way to make your mech even more powerful than just the items that you're putting into it. So in order to fuse it, you could fuse items like that. You can also go into the shop, go into the regular shop here, and you can buy power kits for tokens. So if you go down to the power kits here, you can see all the ones that are available. You've got 5, 1,000, 2,500, or 5,000 points, which are 100 points per token, or you've got the 10,000 kit, which is at a slight discount, and then the 50,000 kits in another discount over that. So depending on how much fusion you're going to do and how many tokens you want to buy, the Ultra Power Kit with 50,000 points is the best bet if you're doing a lot of fusing, but the, the 10,000 10, point kit is also a very good option. So you can take these, go back into your upgrades here. We'll go back to our here, we'll grab another torso here. I think I've got one that I'm working on adding some points to here, so we'll take this one, and we're going to go and put a couple of fusion kits into it. So we'll take these power kits here, and we can see here we upgrade it. It's going to add another 20,000 points to this torso. So there you go. So that's fusion in a nuts nutshell. And again, fusing a torso all the way to maximum adds 75 hit points to it. Legs and weapons adds 15 damage. Drones and specials can also be fused. 
Defuse a drone all the way level 6 is the maximum for drones and specials. Fuse a drone all the way up, you get an extra 5 damage on that one. Same with specials, they get an extra 5 damage added. So again, fusion is great. Um, you definitely want to take some items that you're not using and fuse them into the ones that you are so that you get more damage for no extra cost. I would recommend that you focus on fusing your torsos first. The extra hit points are the most valuable that you're going to get. Um, and then follow that by the weapons that you use most often. Um, so if you're using a physical mech, your weapons that are going to fire in the mid-range, focus on fusing those ones first. I would focus on fusing your drone early as well because that one fires every turn. So that one's going to get you a good return for the fusion points. Um, I would focus on your legs last. Um, unless you're using a design that really focuses on stomping, your legs are more about adding movement and hit points to your mech than they are about damage. So those are the least priority for fusion. That pretty much covers it.